Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. Today we will be doing the end of month flip for my Louis Vuitton small ring or PM agenda. So I was supposed to do a plan with me in here but I just got so busy and I didn't get a chance to do it. So I figured I would do an end of month flip and show y'all how I set this up for my bachelorette weekend in New Orleans and all the changes that I made for travel. So this is my on the go planner. I always take this with me. I really love having it. I have everything that I need, like essentials wide in here. So on the side we have um, my credit card, my business debit card, and then a, another card. And then I have my vaccine card in here just so I can have a designated spot for it. After we get married, I have a lot that I need to do because I want to get like TSA pre-check, but I didn't want to do it now and then my name change and then I have to go through like a name change process. I'm just waiting until after my name changes. Um, and then I'm also getting a passport and again, didn't want to have to go. Th I, I'm just waiting until after we get married so I don't have to do it twice or make any changes. But once I get my passport, I'm going to put it back here and then that way... Again, everything I need is in here for traveling and I have a spot for everything. So on the rings, because this is on the go, it's very compact. So I have all of the dashboards that I have in all of my agendas in here, including an inbox. And then I have a month on one page inserts from Infinite Lotus. Of course, everything will be linked below that I can link. And this just really holds birthdays and I can come in here and write out um, anything that I need to write out. And then I also just keep travel dates in here as well. I need to update this. I haven't done that. But um, then we have the essentials tab from Cloth and Paper. I have these tabs in all of my agendas. I just love how like to the point they are. So the first section is your schedule section. And this is where I just keep all of my plans and anything that I need to reference on the go. So for April, it's been very like minimal. I'll just write in appointments or class or anything that I just need to come in and do or anywhere I need to go. So I honestly didn't use it until like really this upcoming week, um, mainly because I haven't really been doing much either because of school. So there is that. I don't copy in all of the plans. Again, just places that I need to go to or reference and like appointments and whatnot so this is what it looks like very basic but um very useful and then i have about i think six months in here so it goes to i oh know probably seven it goes to july with the weekly inserts and then it goes to june with the monthly inserts and then after that is the travel section so under the notes and list section is where I have these packing list inserts from cloth and paper. So this is my packing list for New Orleans and it's an ongoing list and I've somewhat started packing. I've been sharing um, everything that I'm packing on TikTok. So definitely follow me on there. I'll do a YouTube video as well, um, but I've just been doing those more real time. That's the best part about being able to do like TikTok and Instagram. It's, it's a lot easier to like share real time. So I've been putting those on there. But yeah, um, on this list you have essentials, toiletries, clothing, technology, and shoes. And then on the back, it's customizable so that you can categorize whatever you need. So I have handbags, accessories. This is just bachelorette items. I'm doing like a breakfast at Tiffany's theme. So I have like a black tool dress. I got pearls, like a breakfast at Tiffany, um, breakfast at Tiffany's crown, like a small one that like Audrey Hepburn worn in the opening sequence of the movie. And, um, we're going to do that for brunch. And then I also got sashes. So I got like a bride and co and Tiffany blue sash. It's, I'm really excited to wear it and for this look to come together. And then I also got sashes for everybody who is coming and we got like funny ones off Amazon. Um, I'll do a wedding video soon and share some of that. I might do like a bachelorette edition and share everything that we got as well as decorations. I think I'm going to do a vlog because I haven't done a vlog in a while. 
but we have that and then I just read out earrings that and jewelry that I want to bring and then um underwear um listed down here and then I have one more blank spot but this is how this looks and then I have a second one in here for residency and this is where I'll do a plan with me when I pack for residency um I'll share like how I and I think that'll be more um beneficial to show y'all how I pack for like when I travel because we always go early so that we can um or I can if I'm going by myself like explore um but also what to pack for school so I'll do a plan with me when I um travel plan for that but yeah this is the bachelorette and then I really just wanted to mark down all of the dresses that I got I got a lot of like going out dresses for my bachelorette which I'm really excited to wear and I got way more than I should we're only there for a weekend but um you never know I can do a million outfit changes we're actually staying in um, a hotel downtown so that way it's like easier to get to places and I can change if needed but yeah that is the packing list and then typically I kept like the daily itineraries behind these but because I just want to have it more streamlined I actually need to just remove these and keep it focused to the current trip. Um, under finances is where I put the daily itinerary inserts from Infinite Lotus. I'm sorry, from Cloth and Paper. And this is where I just wrote out um, tentative plans. So we don't have like concrete plans um, on what we're doing. We have like a general idea, but really we also just want to like bar hop and um, like food hop. And while we do you have places that we looked up and we have a list on that we want to try out if the line's too long or we can't get in um we've always had really good luck anywhere in new orleans finding really good food so we kind of just keep it open but have a general idea of where we're going and i've shared in like other travel videos that that's normally what i do so yeah we are leaving this is for friday oh i didn't put in the dates um but we have friday general idea I put in the weather and then for things to do I'll write out like a list of things that we want to do and then we have Saturday and Sunday and then we actually leave Sunday evening so um again very quick trip but class starts on Monday and then I also have to go back to work for Saturday we are probably just going to be staying more around the French Quarter I don't know we'll see um, we do have one reservation at our favorite place to go, and then we've never gone to the Garden District, so we want to do that on Sunday before we leave, um, and just do, like, brunch there, which I'm actually looking forward to trying out something new. So, yeah, that is the daily itinerary inserts and how they work. Oh my god, I have so many spare inserts everywhere. And, yeah, that is the flip through of my PM agenda, a little overview of my trip. And other than that, that is going to be it for this video. If y'all have any questions, please feel free to let me know. And thank you guys so much for watching.